Hello there, welcome back to Pop World. Still to come, Busted, Pink and Liberty X, goodness Ooh. me. But now Holly Valance's bag, it feels oh. like it's been years. I think it has been about a year. About a year? Yeah. Okay then. Do you remember uh, Holly Valance, Pop World Woman of the Year 2002? <laughs> I remember that, I still have that award. Your certificate? Very exciting. And your box of celebrations? No, I ate them. Oh, all of them yourself? <laughs> Pretty much. That was a big freaking tin. <laughs> it was. Has it been a curse in a way? Um, yeah, it's really, you know, hindered a lot of things that I was looking towards doing oh, yeah. and like because what? of it. Because we gave it to you and then you went. You just went. <laughs> the same thing happened the year before. Gave it to Samantha Mumba. Ah. Sometimes I regret that. Other times I think it's a jinx it's then. A good thing. <laughs> Maybe. But you're back now. I am. Now, apart from winning our Pop World Woman of the Year, you also won GQ Woman of the Year. Yeah. Uh, smash hits. Most fanciful woman in the world. Wow. Also, news of the world, uh, sexiest woman in the world. I mean, it's been a wonderful career so far. <laughs> How difficult is it to keep that sort of level? Um, I don't even think those prizes are all very nice and flattering, and I don't really take that much notice of them, though. Oh, it's come kind on. of just a bit sexiest woman in the world. Yeah, it's a lot to kind of carry around on your shoulders, mm. so I try not to think about it. Well, you've got this new publicity campaign. I've seen posters around London. Mm -hmm. Have you sort of sitting legs akimbo on a radiator? Well, I'm hoping to get a deal with a heating company. Oh, that's good oh, work. Yeah. Right. Are you worried that, you know, young children might try to copy you and <laughs> scar themselves? themselves? Yeah. Hopefully not. Yeah, it's a worry, though, isn't it? <laughs> it is. It's not setting a very good example. Oh, well. <laughs> so then why do it, Holly? <laughs> I'm wild. It's rock and roll. You are a bit rock and roll. <laughs> uh, this new video shows it. Just, just cements the fact that Holly is now rock and roll. This is Holly with State of Mind. Damn right, sister. <laughs> oh, it's exciting. <laughs> You've got it all in there. I have. You've got your finger up at one point. Whoa. You're flirting with lesbianism. I mean, who comes up with I this crazy stuff? I didn't flirt. Did I? Did oh, I? Oh, come on now. Oh, come on. There's nearly a kiss, Holly. Oh, no, no, no. It really wasn't that close. I looked at that, actually, and thought, ooh, it's a bit raunchy, but I wasn't. I was probably about there and there, but on the angle. It's all about angles. Yeah. But there is a certain fascination with lesbianism. Mm, not really. I don't really go home and think about it late at night. Just when you've got a single <laughs> to sell. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But there is, uh, there is writhing around. Uh, in the video, a lot of writhing. When a director says, writhe, do you go, oh, okay then, and get down on that floor and just start writhing? Or is it your decision to writhe? Uh, no, of course. I mean, I don't want to do anything that, if I'm really, really uncomfortable with something, I say, look, it's not cool and we just don't do it. But, you know, but there's you... a difference between thinking of the end picture and thinking this could look really good, even though it's embarrassing because there's 50 crew standing in front of me with Isn't lights and things like that. Yeah, of course it is. It's embarrassing performing sometimes because, you know, if there's not an audience or whatever, it, you know, yeah. you can get nervous and it's just something you have to kind of think of the end product. Yeah, how do you be sexy. I wouldn't have a clue. I'm directed to do, you know, and certain do things and you just listen and hope for the best. So they say speed it up and stuff? Yeah, all More that, slow it writhing. down, speed More it up. Mm. All that jazz. All that jazz. <laughs> Is it ever a dirty floor? That was really, <laughs> it stunk, it was horrible, but they put glycerin on the floor as well to make it look wet and it ended up everyone slipping around and could have been a disaster. And will you well. be rocking and rolling your way through the whole of this album? I'm hoping to. Okay, good. So subversive. <laughs> uh, now, Pink. Yes. Who knows what the future holds for her? Possibly she'll shack up with Sandy Toxic. But the past, that's the important thing. Here's Pink with her blast from the past. What's